And so we have one body here, and then we have fnet equals mj. Now remember, we didn't need that t, and so we're gonna do m total equals mg, or m total a, sorry, m total a equals mg. Now remember, we need this, the total m, the total mass, so that would be 4m plus m equals 5m, right? The total mass of everything would be 5m, so I get 5m a equals mg, the m's cancel, so I get a equals g divided by 5, okay? And so one body is usually a little bit easier to set up, but let's go ahead and look at what it would look for a two body. So for this, we're gonna have two separate free body diagrams. Um, so we have T here, we also have MG and T. Remember this one is the 4MG, so I put 4 or 4M mass, okay? Then the other one, remember this is direction of acceleration, so that's gonna be positive. The other one, I have mg that one is just mg because the mass is just m and then here we also have t remember down is going to be a positive acceleration that's the direction of the acceleration so i'm going to set that as positive so let's set up an f net for this direction so f net here the only force that's contributing to my acceleration is tension so that's my f net okay and then it's going to be 4 m a equals t and then over here we're going to have something like f net equals mg minus t, right? So remember, down is positive because that's the direction of acceleration. And then since my mass is just m, it's going to be ma equals mg minus t. Okay, now remember, once again, we're going to take this and we need to figure out how to plug it in over here, okay? So I just have ma equals mg minus 4ma. And then I'll add that to the other side, so I'll have 5ma equals mg. And you notice that this looks very similar to this, right? Now, they should get the same answer, so it makes sense that they're the same. So, m is cancel, and I'm left with a equals g divided by 5. So, that's kind of the basics of how to set up a multi-body problem. Multi-body meaning multiple objects. Force questions. Um, we can set it up as a one body question or alternatively we can also set up set it up as a two body question remember if you have questions let me know thanks so much